I know there are clothing items out there that make us look a bit aged, and Bermuda shorts are one of those items. So I want to show you how to create outfits with your Bermuda shorts to look more youthful and stylish. And so as you're out and about wearing your wonderful longer shorts, remember to love your neighbor and be kind. When you are trying to figure out what tops to pair with your longer, looser Bermuda shorts, I think a good thing to ask yourself is what can I put on that helps me keep my shape? Because a lot of times when you put those longer, shapeless tops on with these, then that's when you start to look really frumpy. And I chose this cardigan to go with this, one, because I thought it was a perfect match with color, and two, I think the style is great because it comes to my hip line, so it's shorter, which gives me good proportions in my top and my bottom, and it has this cute little puff sleeve that actually helps balance the looser shorts. And I actually think this outfit gives me a little bit more curvy shape than I think I really have. And so I think this is a perfect pairing and I know you can find very similar tops like this or even the exact same kind of cardigans and this one might still be available. So I will link it for you and it does come in solid colors. But I just thought it was a cute look for a casual outfit. So I just put on my white sneakers and I think the white sneakers keep it bright and casual. And even though they're sneakers and flats, I still think that this outfit is great, even though I'm 5'4", because some people don't think that you can wear flats or um, round toe shoes or anything with shorts like these, and I really think you can. I don't think they mess it up. I actually think they add to it and make it look that much better. So I thought this was a really fun outfit and a great example to show you that you can pair some kind of frilly feminine tops with your longer shorts and it actually makes them look really good. It makes them look more feminine because you've added some frill. And these are kind of opposite styles that you would really match together and that's why I really like them. And I did add a belt to this outfit because I thought it looked better than just leaving that waistband plain. And of course, the pointed toe ballet flats, which I love. They're nude with a black cap toe. So they kind of disappear until you get to the cap toe. So I think they look really cool. And since they do have the nude color in them, I wanted to add that color back just to have more of a cohesive look with this outfit. And I think this is a great outfit that you could wear in the summertime, out to dinner, or you know, to a more casual meeting if you are allowed to wear shorts. So I wanted to have a little bit of fun and see if this new tank top that I got from Anthropology would go with these shorts. And so when I put it on, I thought it was a really, really good option to dress them up a bit. And I think the bow ties on the shoulders really helps this tank top look really special. And the V-neck in the front and the back is gorgeous. And I think I think it is made of casual materials, but it looks dressed up. So I thought it was really fun with these shorts. I added the bow belt to it, and then I added my strappy kitten heels. And I think these are really pretty shoes and they kind of draw your eye down to my feet. And so I think this is a really nice dressed up option that you could wear even to, you go to a cookout that's a little bit more fancy or, you know, a party in the summertime. And I think an outfit like this is a lot of fun. And then I added the fun clutch to not be so serious about it. And I just thought this was a good way to have a dressed up look that you would be really, really comfortable, but very confident in. So I wanted to create a very easy and casual outfit with these shorts. So I just threw on my white crew neck t-shirt and I think most of us have some type of white t-shirt in our closet. And this one is really crisp. It's new, which I love it when they're new. And it's a little bit oversized, so it has this drop shoulder. And all I've done is tuck it in and blouse it out, which I think still looks really good. And I didn't put a belt on because I wanted this outfit to stay really, really casual. But I did add some fun accessories and this hoop and my shoes and bracelet that are silver, which is very on trend right now. And I did choose a strappy sandal because I think they are really, really nice. 
but you can wear any flat sandal with yours and I think it would work. And then I did add a sling bag, which I think is so much fun and so very functional for me during the day. And I think it just adds a cute element to the outfit. But you could choose whatever bag you wanted. A cute crossbody would be great. And I just think this is a very good version that you could replicate with your longer shorts and just wear it anywhere you need to go this summer. Now let's look at these Bermuda shorts, which are a five pocket jean style. And these are a little bit slimmer in the legs, so they will allow you to wear a little bit more with them, I think. And one of those things would be just a cutesy little top that you just don't want to tuck in. And I think this one, even though it is still loose and a little longer, I still think it works because the shorts are slimmer and it actually covers a little bit more of the shorts if that makes you feel better. You can always front tuck it if you want to, and that looks good, and it will depend on your body shape. But for those of you that don't want to, just know that you can still create a stylish outfit with something like this. And then I did add just the cutesy bow espadrilles because I just thought they were fun, and they just added a little bit of a fun element to maybe two boring colors if you don't put something exciting with them, which I think the shoes do that. But I do love the olive green and the black together. I think it's a good combination. And I think this is a fantastic outfit that still looks very youthful and very stylish for you. So here's a very casual but updated casual version for your Bermuda shorts. And I just chose a metallic t-shirt, which metallics are very big right now. And this one actually comes in lots of different colors if you wanna check it out. But I really loved the silver. And I kept a black shoe on with this one just because I wanted to keep it very simple. So I just chose a cute little bow flat sandal, but you could also do a sneaker if you wanted to. And then I have silver earrings on and I used my sling bag again because this is my runaround daily bag and this would be an outfit that I would put on to run errands go to the grocery or do whatever I needed to do during the day so I love this as an updated look for your Bermuda shorts so if you have a jean pair of Bermuda shorts just throw on a really cool t-shirt and your favorite flats and a fun bag and I think you're good to go I decided to get a little creative and take the vest that actually matches the blue shorts from the beginning of the video and put them with the black Bermuda shorts because I thought this was a very on trend and youthful look. All I did was take the vest and I only buttoned it one time here to keep it open and casual. And I did put it over just a white tank top that has this cute little seashell on it. And I did leave it untucked because it didn't hang out of the vest and I liked seeing it more down here as opposed to it being tucked in and seeing the shorts. I don't know, I just thought it looked a little bit better this way. And then I did add just a pair of casual white sneakers with some gold lacing so I could put some gold accessories on and then this cute little bag which I like to wear across my body. And I think this is absolutely a fun outfit that you can wear on the daily. So you could wear it wherever you wanted to go, run errands, and you're going to be comfortable and on trend and very, very cute. Oh, and I almost forgot to mention that you should definitely check out my dynamic duo video, which has this vest and the shorts together as a two-piece set and some other awesome two-piece sets in it. If you want to check that out, I will link it for you below. I wanted to include an outfit that was super easy for you to replicate where you wouldn't have to worry about tucking anything in or tying anything up. So I just took a nice little ribbed fitted t-shirt that's not too, too long. So it stops right at my hip line, which is perfect. And then I put a denim jacket over it just to make it a little bit more stylish and fun. And I love this one because it has a nice puff sleeve and it's really inexpensive from Walmart and it's one of my favorite jackets I've ever had. And I think the length is really good with the shorts and it matches the length of the t-shirt. And I also put on just a pair of fun, sparkly shoes. These are a mesh Mary Jane that's very on trend and it's a neutral color so you can wear it with just about anything. And I just thought it added a nice touch to this outfit. And then I did add just a little bit of print to the outfit with the clutch to make it look a little bit more summery. And I just think this is something easy that you could replicate with some of your pieces and just pull them out of your closet and put them on and have a cute outfit. I am super excited to show you this one because I told you these could be dressed up and I really 
think that this is a nice dressy summer look with shorts and Bermuda shorts that are supposedly frumpy. And I don't think this is frumpy at all. The reason why this longer top works is because it's cinched in the waist and there's so many pretty feminine elements about this and it's just really attractive. And I don't think the shorts take away from it. I think the shorts are slim enough that they look good with a top like this. And then I added the strappy shoes to keep with that dressed up look. And I think the strappy shoes are a little bit more sexy and appealing. And then I added a sparkly clutch and some gold accessories to bring the outfit all together. And this is a perfect dressed up summer party look. So that is all I have for you today. Thank you so much for watching. And if you love this video, please give it a thumbs up and also consider subscribing. And I will talk to you next time.